chifriends.org, you will be able to install XAMPP where you can install PHP and the Apache server and also MySQL database. And you can download the XAMPP application depending upon your operating system. So I'm going to click here on a click here for other versions and choose your operating system. And I'm going to choose XAMPP for Mac and the version is going to be 7.2. So this one, I'm going to download this one. Click on download. And once it's finished, you can now open the installer. And the process is very, very simple and straightforward. For all operating systems, you can just click on a few nexts and it will install XAMPP for you. So if you are using Mac, then you can follow along. If you are using another operating system, then the process is, is very, very similar and it's self-explanatory. And it might ask you for your PC or Mac password, so you need to type it. And it will open a wizard where you can just click on a few nexts and it will install XAMPP for you. So here, once here it opens this wizard, click on next and then make sure you check these two and click on next and then here it says that it will be installed XAMPP will be installed inside applications slash XAMPP folder click on next and you can check or uncheck this if you wish to learn more about XAMPP and then finally just click on next and it will start downloading Finally, once it's finished, you will find that XAMPP has been installed in your applications. So as you can see here, I have XAMPP and these are all of the files. In order to use PHP version 7, you need to head on over to your terminal and make sure that you are using a PHP version 7. So here I'm going to type PHP and then version of uh, hyphen version or V and here it says 7.2 and if it doesn't say here PHP 7.2 then you need to make sure that you add the to add um, XAMPP to your path and in order to do so just open your uh, bash profile and inside bash profile make sure to add these two lines at the end of the file path equals to slash applications slash exam all capital letters and then slash exam files slash bin and then colon and then dollar sign path and then export that path so these two lines are very important in case your mac is using um PHP version other than 7.2 so make sure you add these two lines in your uh, dot bash profile and then save make sure that you save after that click on save and of course you need to close the terminal and open a new terminal and make sure that you are uh, now using PHP version uh, seven. 